Wandering Winter continuing my look at Dominion openings. Today we're going to look at Skulk. So Skulk is a card that does not much for you, gives you plus a buy. It attacks your opponent a little bit, but it comes with a gold, and that's the important thing for the opening. So the general purpose opening that we can talk about here is Skulk Silver. Obviously there could be other openings that involve Skulk, but they're not going to be available all the time. Skulk Silver... Um, yeah, so you have a 13-card deck. You see there's eight cards still in the draw pile. So gold is better than silver, but your deck being bigger is worse. It's kind of the opposite um, of when you talk about silver, silver versus um, peddler, silver, or silver moat, that kind of a thing. How silver, silver is... Uh, gives you more ch more chance to hit five more times or to hit bigger amounts than the other options, but it's less reliable and uh, you end up having to get through more of your shuffle. Um, after turn three, you've still got two cards. Here after turn four, excuse me, after turn four, you've still got two cards with silver, silver. Here after turn four, we're gonna have three cards from our opening shuffle. So that's worth noting. However, we want to know what it does for hitting our price points. Um, so for hitting uh, really high price points, it's actually better than Silver Silver or Silver Moat or Silver Peddler or any of that stuff. You get a 57% chance of hitting at least six opening Skulk Silver compared to opening Silver Silver, which gave you like a 42% chance. So that's a a small but quite noticeable increase if you're trying to hit six. Um, you even have a tiny, tiny chance of hitting six twice, but that's quite negligible. Um, in terms of hitting five, um, it's a higher risk, higher reward proposition compared to something like Silver Silver, right? You have a 87% chance of hitting five at least once by opening Skulk Silver. Um, and you realize that's going to be um, like four or five percent lower than opening silver, silver, and even a bit further compared to peddler silver or moat silver. And uh, on top of that, you also uh, can hit five twice, fifteen point seven percent of the time, uh, which is better than you know other openings we've seen. Although it's very close to the silver silver number. So you end up with fewer fives if five is what you're going for than compared to silver silver overall, but a higher chance at sixes. And yeah, you have this skulk in your deck as well. So it's really, I'm not gonna bother calculating, I haven't bothered calculating what the skulk attack does to your opponent's chances of hitting five, because do I hit it turn three or turn four? Is my opponent player one or player two? What did they open? There's a whole lot of variables, not to mention 12 different hexes uh, against all the different hands that your opponent could have. Um, but know that the, the Skulk also does hamper your opponent's ability to hit price points by giving Envious or Poverty or, right, some of, the, some of, these, uh, some of these hexes can, can hurt. Um, hurt there, as, as well as potentially, you know, giving them a curse or something. So so there's that to contribute as well. I think in general, particularly if you're trying to hit five, I don't favor opening Skulk, largely because the extra card to get through means it's, you're going to be slower to hit the fives. But it's not a crazy opening. And if the Skulk is going to be good for you in other ways, um, for instance, if there is a useful way on the board, um, that might be a reason that you'd prefer to go Skulk Silver. Or if, so like Way of the Horse is probably the biggest example, but also Way of the Butterfly, right? That's that's a great reason to open Skulk. Um, so there are lots of reasons for that. The biggest one probably to note is if you're going to end up with some kind of a trash for benefit card where you have a gold and then you have a four cost card that you don't find trashing so much. Um, I'll also note that if you're just playing pure money for whatever reason and Skulk's the only card on the board, 
taking Skulk is a lot better than taking Silver. A lot of that's down to the attack, but hitting six rather than being more apt to hit five uh, is a bigger deal for that deck than, than for a bunch of other decks. Um, so yeah, if you're trying to spike six, you could think about Skulk as well. Um, yeah, so a little bit more nuance here. I don't tend to favor opening Skulk, but there are several situations where it's something to consider. Thanks for watching.